this unless people like you who have been victimized will press charges. Never. When my book comes out, a great man will finally take his place in history. It's all in here. Well, what is it? My life's work. Millard Feigenbaum, the father of our country. <laughs> Millard Feigenbaum? I have absolute documented proof with footnotes that Millard Feigenbaum was the first president of the United States. How about that? <laughs> Mentally, everybody knows that George Washington is... <laughs> George Washington. Don't mention the name of that imposter. Imposter? Exactly. George Washington, whose real name, incidentally, was Harold Kramer. You didn't know that, did you? <laughs> it's all in here. Well, anyway, Harold, or if you will, George Washington, was really a front put in the White House by the powdered wig lobby. <laughs> powdered wig lobby? That's right. How else do you think a stupid thing like powdered wigs was able to sweep the country in the 1700s? No, really, Bentley, and a powdered... they're still around. They're the same people who are behind President Kennedy's haircut. <laughs> talking about? Do you think President Kennedy really wants that much hair? Oh, no. He's in their power. Well, that's the most ridiculous, ridiculous thing. Ridiculous. Open your eyes, Captain. Now, everybody knows our country is founded on the glories of our great presidents, like George Washington and Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> wait, wait, no. What was that? That last name you mentioned. Abraham Lincoln, our 16th president. You mean Otto Schmidlap. <laughs> Otto Schmidlap? Yes, he was our 16th president. Abraham Lincoln was just another front for the hair lobby, only they moved it down to here. You believe that? Believe it. It's all in my next book, The Truth About the Civil War. The Truth About the Civil War? Yes, I have documents. Facts and figures to prove without a doubt that the Civil War was just a fight between the, the hair lobby and the razor interests. Arise, America! Remember Feigenbaum! <laughs> Captain, I want those phony publishers arrested. We'll do our best. Boys, we've got to nab those publishers fast. Say, who was that screwball who just came running out of here yelling, Remember Feigenbaum? <laughs> you never heard of Millet Feigenbaum? Yeah. I'm bad on names. Who is Millard Feigenbaum? The first president of the United States. <laughs> well, you live and learn. <laughs>